Hey guys, today we're doing something a little different because my house hopefully appears clean on the surface, but underneath there are some dirty. What? Oh, no, no, no. Nasty things. Wow. That I had no idea you were supposed to clean. Whoops. So we are going to tackle it today and it is going to be satisfying. First, we are heading down under the fridge. Oh my. We got this. Take a fly swatter and cover it with a cloth and a hair tie. Water with vinegar and lemon. It smells so good. Oh, this is very enjoyable in an odd way. I got you. Look at this stuff and how clean it is now. Okay, next we're heading to the washer, which in two years has never been washed itself. <laughs> so under the drum is the filter. First, remove this nozzle and let it have a good pee. Now you can unscrew. Oh, we've been slimed. <laughs> okay, clean that. Let's pop out the soap dispenser, which I've never done. Next, the gasket. Oh, no, no, no. I don't normally use things with bleach, but I think this is a mold situation. So we're gonna let it sit for 30. Wow. Okay, from now on, I am always leaving this door open. Next to the dryer. So we usually do this, but I'm gonna deep clean it. You guys, I don't know why I love cleaning things with toothbrushes. And then have you ever wondered where this goes? I'm gonna show you, but we need to climb out the window. <laughs> That's the dryer vent. Whoa, look at that, it's like hard. We can't take it off, so we're gonna wet and scrub. I promise we're tossing this. Yeah, I think we increased the airflow by like 90%. You're retired. Uh, next I see the toaster. Lots of hard to reach crumbs. Look at that. We're gonna take a damp paintbrush and loosen those up and then clean the tray. And then for that burnt grime on the top, I have seen this pink stuff everywhere. We're gonna try it. Oh. You have to be pretty gentle because it does scratch, but wow, I think this is looking good. Okay, next, does anyone wanna see what's in my sink disposal? You guys are like, no! Oh, okay. I blame it on the sitter. No, stuff just sits there, so we are making our own cleaning pods with these lemons and vinegar poured into an ice tray. Magically frozen, <laughs> three hours later. Definitely smells better. Looks better too, next. I need coffee. Uh, this has never been cleaned. They really do make so many cleaning pods I did not know about. So we're gonna, oh, it's like foaming. One more water cycle. Super easy and look at the difference. Cheers, we're heading upstairs. All right, so I'm in fourth room because the vents in bathrooms get really dirty. Never really looked up there, but we're getting them all. Oh, it's like falling on me. Another one, I can't believe I didn't see this. I'm now in Presley's room and the reason there is so much stuff is that the exhaust fan appears to be very dirty, but accessing it through the attic seems a little taunting. So we are going to make something ridiculous. It's not perfect, but we're getting stuff. I just realized the kids are coming home soon, so we're gonna speed things up pillows the actual pillow. Check the label first, but I read that in two years, unwashed pillows can accumulate a third of their weight in bugs, dust, and dead skin cells. Ah, I'm glad we did this. Shower heads, what? You can usually unscrew them. Look at that. Um, I'm a little late as you can see some corrosion, but definitely cleaner. Take a closer look at your toothbrushes and you might see a lot of grime. Ugh. We're gonna wash those. Then put whatever you can in the dishwasher. And when that's done, check in on your food trap, ugh, and clean that. Another pod, why not? Plants, either real or in our case artificial, accumulate so much dust, so we are gently wiping them, and this may look tedious, but it is so satisfying. Oh hi, couch crevices. It feels oddly good to wrap your hand in tape so that you can reach deep down and get absolutely everything. Wow, I think more effective than a vacuum. Look at that hair. And finally, I gotta shout out magic erasers. I know walls are very visible, but I often don't see to clean them. Doors too, geez, oh, someone clearly needs to wash their hands more. Speaking of, one last thing, the inside of cleaning gloves gets super germy, so oh, make sure to soak them. 
Okay, I cannot handle any more cleaning. Um, as much as I know my kids are going to appreciate this. Did you notice your bathroom vent? No. I really needed you guys along as motivation. So thank you for watching. Let me know what other filthy things you clean below and I will see you soon. Bye. Guys, look at this production value right there. <laughs>